What's up, movie lovers? Today we're gonna go check Dollar Tree and see if they got any Blu-rays in. I've never had a lot of success, but I have had some, so I think I'm gonna go check it out. Be sure to click subscribe and click on the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload great new content. There is one more Dollar Tree in the area, so I'm going to go check that one out. Okay guys, I decided to record the haul portion of this video here in the studio because the sunlight was at an angle where it made the video not look very good. So you guys got to see the footage of me going to the Dollar Trees and uh, this is probably gonna be my best Dollar Tree haul video ever. So I went to, so I had seen other popular YouTubers, you know, uh, they said the Dollar Trees were getting in new movies again. They seem to be doing this a lot, and I don't understand how they can sell these for so cheap. Like, if they can make a profit off of them, you know, like, how come Amazon is still charging so much more for these movies? You know what I mean? I just don't understand the logistics of it, but uh, somebody's loss is definitely our gain. So I went to the first Dollar Tree, and I only found a few titles. Uh, it looked mostly like maybe the stuff from the last time they were getting them in. I, I, I went last time, I think, and I didn't find anything. It didn't seem like the Dollar Trees around me had anything. And I don't go to the Dollar Tree very often, so I probably haven't been since last time people were saying they found stuff at Dollar Tree. I did find a few titles, though, so let's just go over those real quick. Um, I think this is the IT crowd. It could be the IT crowd, but I think it's supposed to be the IT crowd. This is the complete first season I've never seen this show. It's six episodes, approximately 144 minutes. So it's a little over two hours only. Uh, but maybe at some point I will be able to check this one out. Uh, also got this one, Hell at My Heels, Bound Together for Vengeance. Uh, I've never heard of this one. It's a 90 minute runtime from 2012. And uh, I mean, the the stills there don't look very good but for a dollar no matter how bad a movie is for a dollar i mean it's not like you're gonna be like oh, i wasted all my money <laughs> you know uh picked up this one too super fast on dvd i'm pretty sure i watched this one on netflix or amazon prime and i probably have a review of it up unfortunately i didn't pay attention the disc is loose in there so hopefully it's not too scratched up fast cars hot women and big guns i remember they were they had this uh good the rock character in this one, I think. If this is the one I'm thinking of, and I'm pretty sure it is. And the guy, he even kind of looks a little bit like Vin Diesel. Um, this one is rated PG-13, has a 99 minute runtime. Uh, so they had a few Blu-rays. Uh, this is the second best exotic Marigold Hotel. And I was thinking this was something else, but uh, I, I don't have the first one anyways. This one's rated PG has a runtime that I can't find, uh, 123 minutes, Judy Dench, Maggie Smith, Bill Nye, Dave Patel, and Richard Gere. If nothing else, maybe the wife will like it. Uh, and Steven Seagal, driven to kill. Uh, this one is rated R. Uh, this one's from 2013, it looks like. I'm not seeing the run 98 minute runtime. Uh, you could tell just like how low quality the printing is on this. And then one that I actually wanted to check out anyways, Zipper. I don't think I ever got it. Patrick Wilson, Lena Haiti, 
John Cho, Diana Argan, Ray Winston, and Richard Dreyfuss. So this one actually has some well-known stars. Uh, this one's rated R. Uh, has a runtime of 112 minutes. A federal prosecutor on the fast track to political success risks his promising career and family life to indulge the ever-obsessive impulsion of his secret addiction to escorts. So it could be interesting. I remember this came out not that, not that long ago and I had it in my shopping guide. So really for, I mean, it could have been last year, I don't know for sure, but to already be down to a dollar. Now for the second Dollar Tree. They had, when I walked in, they had the bin up front. Almost all DVDs, there was like this many Blu-rays. They were all of the newer stuff though. Now I only had about five or six. Went over to where they usually put them on the aisle. <laughs> Went over to where they usually put them on the aisle. I think they had pretty much all of everything. Uh, the only thing I think I didn't see was Spider-Man. Wasn't there supposed to be a Spider-Man? But I already have all the Spider-Man, so it's not a big loss to me. Uh, some of these titles I might already have too. I didn't look them up. Uh, some of them I might already have on DVD. This one is The Counselor, unrated extended cut, includes two versions, unrated extended cut and theatrical, Michael Fassbender, Penelope Cruz, Cameron Diaz, Javier Bardem, and Brad Pitt, a Ridley Scott film. So, I mean, this has tons of names in it. Uh, rated R versions and unrated versions, 117 minutes, 138 minutes in this one. They did have that one orange or oranges or whatever. Uh, doesn't that have Hugh Laurie? They said it wouldn't scan, so they couldn't sell it. I'm not mad, but at the same time, I don't understand the reasoning. It's the dollar store, right? Everything there is a dollar. Wouldn't they rather just charge you a dollar and give you what you're trying to buy instead of saying, oh, we can't sell you this because we don't want to make money? <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't really care. But uh, I might even already have that one. <laughs> Sometimes it's just hard to find movies you already own. <laughs> uh, the Fault in Our Stars. I don't have this one for sure. Uh, I remember buying this one for my mom though. Little Infinities Extended Edition, The Fault in Our Stars. Blu-ray DVD and Digital HD includes extended and theatrical editions. Uh, this one's rated PG-13 and there's an unrated version as well. Uh, 100, both 100, oh wait, that's the Blu-ray and the DVD, 126 minutes. They don't say uh, which version, it's probably a theatrical version. They don't say the extended version. Uh, Tom Cruise and Cameron Diaz, Day and Night. I never did see this one. Uh, this one is rated PG-13 and has a runtime of 109 minutes. Uh, if I didn't mention that, it does have Blu-ray and digital. Uh, I'm not sure if I own this one or not. I know I've never seen it. Limitless. Uh, this is where Bradley Cooper like has unlimited powers or something. I think he has a, it takes a drug or something. And they did create a TV show after it, but I've never seen either. I'm not really finding the, uh, the rating or the runtime on here. <laughs> Brick Mansions. I can't remember if I ever saw this one or not. I know I do have it, but it's like the rental version. So, uh, decided to pick this one up. It has the Blu-ray and digital. So that way I could get the special features, I guess. It uh, has two versions, theatrical and unrated. Theatrical is rated PG-13. And I can't seem to find... Oh, 90-minute runtime. Uh, could there be more noises outside? Special features on the set with Paul Walker becoming Termaine. And brick by brick, creating the characters. And I found Zipper over there with the slip cover so I went ahead and picked this one up so I could have the slip cover another dollar whatever <laughs> uh joy this is the one with uh I can't think of it right now Jennifer Lawrence Robert De Niro and Bradley Cooper kind of a ding on the front uh rated PG-13 has a runtime of 124 minutes I'm not really sure what this one was about Badge of Honor. I only got a couple DVDs over there. This one does have the slipcover. I just got this one basically because it had Mina Suvari. It does also have Haley Duff and Martin Sheen. I don't know if I've ever seen Haley Duff in anything. Not rated. Runtime of 98 minutes. I was hoping to get this one. Uh, my dad had bought this one before, but on DVD. And I was like, oh, I'm not watching a DVD. I don't care. <laughs> uh, let's be cops. I don't think I ever saw it. 
pretty sure I never did, and I'm sure I'm going to be very underwhelmed by it. But it is rated R. Has a runtime of 104 minutes. I think these guys pretend to be cops. Uh, parental Guidance. This is the Blu-ray, DVD, and digital copy. Billy Crystal, Bette Midler, and Marissa Tomei. Tom Everett Scott. Like, like Marissa Tomei could ever go for short, corky, bald, stocky men, you know? <laughs> this one has a runtime of 105 minutes and is rated PG. This one, one of the worst movies ever made, movie 43, uh, has Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. 94 minute runtime, R-rated version and unrated version. I did see this one. I was on Netflix. It's basically just a bunch of short stories and I've heard a lot of things and I don't remember exactly how it was. They kind of just tricked all these actors into being in it and it ends up being just like the most terrible, unfunny, disgusting piece of junk really ever made. But for a dollar, I'll watch it again. Uh, this one has Mila jo Mila Jovovich, Pierce Brosnan, Dylan McDermott, Angela Bassett, and Robert Foster, Survivor. It's rated PG-13. Has a runtime of 96 minutes. We're almost there, I swear. Uh, the other DVD I got, Felony, Tom Wilkinson, Joel Egerton, Jai Courtney, and Melissa George. Felony, One Moment Can Change Everything. This one's not rated, has a runtime of 104 minutes. I know I have this one, but I don't know if it's... It might have been on one of those other dollar store the halls or whatever, stolen with Nicolas Cage. Got the Transporter 2 with Jason Statham. This one includes Blu-ray and digital. I have the DVD, but I didn't have it on Blu-ray. So for a dollar, definitely worth upgrading that one. And the last one I got was Paper Towns. Now this has Blu-ray, DVD, and digital HD. It's rated PG-13. has a runtime of 109 minutes. So that is the complete haul right there. Uh, I think this was under uh, 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So tw 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 22 movies for under $30. You can't beat that, even if they're, they're terrible, whatever. It doesn't matter. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Uh, if you guys are going out to Dollar Tree, love to hear about what you guys are finding. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave it a like rating. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. Check out the videos. Check them out at sitebobsmoviereview.com. And I'll see you guys next time.